Hi everyone, so just recently I was told that in the Sano G Mode 11 nightly builds it is impossible to reduce the overall display color saturation whereas in the stock room you would have options for profiles that would get the job done. So if you are using Sano G Mode 11 and you wish to see more natural colors than the oversaturated ones there is a solution. Thanks to Peter Semper for letting me know about this and thanks of course to F4K from his developers forums for making all of this possible. So in this video what we are about to do is we are about to push uh, an APK file modified by F4K that will allow us to do these changes on the Sano Gmod 11 ROM. So start off by downloading the APK from the link in the video description, download it to your SD card, internal storage or whatever and once you have done that use a root browsing tool. My favorite is root, is root explorer so this one I'm gonna use. Anyways, whatever you have put the APK file find it, in my case it should be in the directory SD card which is the phone's internal storage. Here it is. So, either copy or move this Galaxy for mini settings AP key and put it in system. Make sure that it is read right by the way. So just mount it like this and then app. Paste it. In case you cannot find it, you can just look for it. So I'm gonna search for S4 Mini for example. And here it is. Now we need to set the permissions. This is how what the permissions should look like in the checkboxes. Make them like this and this is how they should look next to the file name. So once you have done that exit everything and reboot your phone. The next time the phone starts up you should see a message Android is optimizing apps. That means you have successfully installed this APK file. And now once the phone starts back up unlock it and head into your settings. Then here into display and now you should see this extra option here which you didn't have before which is called advanced settings. Now if you head in here you can see how you have these options here. Now these settings here in mode might look familiar to you. If you remember on the stock ROM you have ad adapt display, uh, natural movie and so on. So by changing these you are changing the saturation of your colors. For example if I set it to movie or to uh, natural I can I can see the changes with my eyes. My camera cannot probably see this, but it does change the colors. So yeah, you can set that to auto and also you can change the uh, screen color temperature. But this only will apply if you turn off the screen and turn it back on. For example, I'm gonna set it to cold. I'm gonna turn off the screen. I'm gonna put it back on, and there you go. So that's pretty much it everyone, huge thanks to Peter Semper once again for letting me know about this and of course huge thanks to F4K for making all of this possible. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, if you did please hit the like button, if you haven't subscribed already please do so, I promise you more videos like this in the future. Once again everyone thank you for watching and I'll see you next time, goodbye.